okay L let me tell you that the ada boost is the first stepping stone in the world of boosting algorithms okay it is the first ever boosting algorithms which was invented yet okay so ada boost uh, it works on a principle that one way for a new predictor to correct its predecessor is to pay a bit more attention to the training instances that the predecessor has incorrectly classified okay as i told you or uh, the whole boosting is based on the idea that uh, the weakness of the first model is passed to the second model and then the weakness of the second passed to third and up till n models so like this way uh, following this approach only ada boost what it does it basically assigns more weights to the incorrectly classified samples and give less weights to the correctly classified samples okay this results in a new predictor focusing more and more on the hard cases so this technique is used by ada boost okay so for example to build an ada boost classifier a first base classifier such as a decision tree which is trained and is used to make predictions on the training set the relative weight of the misclassified samples they are increased and passed uh, to the second classifier second weak learner okay these updated weights are passed to second then the misclassified weights of the second uh, model they are passed to the third model like this way a double boost works okay so now before starting the working of the ada boost i would uh, like you all to understand about what is stump okay you all know about decision trees how decision trees are made we can build decision trees up till any level up to fourth level eight level 10 level up till any level we can make decision trees but in ada boost what it does uh, it uh, uh, makes uh, this stump with the help of a single node and two leaves okay this is basically uh, uh, they are the weak learners in the ada boost okay the weak learners which i was talking about in ada boost algorithm this stump is only that weak learner okay so the uh, one thing to focus on is the order of these stumps they are very important in ada boost because as i told you that we are passing the error of the first stump to the second stump and then uh, the error of the second stump is passed to the third stump so uh, the error of the first stump influences how the other stump is made so that's why the order is very important you can't shuffle among the stumps you have to keep a particular order of these stumps okay so now let's move